Yeah, so I was still in college, and honestly, I was bored. Um, I was just, I was an English major, so I was just buried in books and felt really, like, creatively stifled by the academic routine and rigor. And I thought, okay, I, I need a creative outlet, but I have no time. You know, I had no time to, like, I like to, like, make things and craft and bake and use my hands, and I just had no time for any of that. And I thought, okay, well, I have to get dressed every day, um, so why don't I use that as a way to infuse creativity into my day? And I came up with the idea to try wearing a dress every day for a month. It happened to be November of 2009 when I had the idea, and so I was like, okay, the next full month is December. I'll wear only dress is in December and I love puns and I came up with the name December and was like okay that's too good I have to do it um and then I I did it I wore a dress every day for the month of December and, it, and never planned on doing it again it was um it was fun but it was never intended to be an annual thing um but then the next year some of my girlfriends wanted to join in totally thought they must be bored as well <laughs> but I was like okay let's do it and then the next year some of their girlfriends wanted to join in and so at that point when it was um, women I didn't know personally I thought oh, okay this isn't just my friends humoring me this is a good idea people like this um, I joke that I have a lot of bad ideas that never go anywhere and so it was really easy to recognize a good idea that was moving beyond my immediate circle and that's when I started to dream about what more it could be and adding a layer to it and a heart and a cause. Um, and so two years later in 2013 is when I aligned a dress number with anti-human trafficking.